Right, uh, hello there guys, I'm Floyd, I'll be doing a bit of gaming on Green Life, and I'm going to start off with Command & Conquer, Heroes Revenge. I've decided on this because I haven't really played it much, and I haven't got any further than the third campaign for the Allies, so I'm going to do that now. Although, I have played the first one recently, because I tried to record it and failed badly. So, uh, there's a little cutscene here. So I'll try and quiet him. The situation looks bad, Commander. Yuri's forces have successfully detonated two of his psychic dominator devices, turning much of the planet into mindless Yuri drones. Luckily, the device here in San Francisco seems to be underpowered. It hasn't been activated yet. Stand by, Commander. I have Special Agent Tanya on the line. Well, that's not suitable. There may be a way really, out of this, like a war. Doc Einstein has a new toy. Now it hasn't been tested yet, but unless she has like Kevlar implants or something. Doc. This is my prototype temporal displacement device. I believe we can use it to transport your forces backwards in time. So it's a time machine. You may be able to avert the psychic dominator disaster before Why can't it has I just say begun? time machine? But we don't have a lot of time, Commander. But if that's Yuri's Einstein, wouldn't even like a hundred odd years old. The city to divert power to the psychic dominator. Even in well, this the universe. Power too. So you have to get out there and you have to capture power plants yourself. Hey, it's inventing a time machine at like a hundred years old. Job. I'm not a strategist. And I hate to admit it, but right now I wish General Carter was still my device works, Miss Tanya. You may get your wish. When you return to the past, contact my earlier self. I may be able to help. Yeah. Right, so catch power plants to power the time machine, defend the time machine, and destroy the dominator on Alcatraz. Yeah, like I haven't played this too much. Usually plays Yuri and the Soviets as well, not big bang allies. The bad guy's Yuri, he can control minds and is generally a massive dick. Establishing battlefield control. Stand by. That's quite clearly a bad idea, isn't it? That's a very safe looking nuclear reactor. Incoming I see no way it can go wrong. The time machine is just south of the Golden Gate Bridge. Yes. It's there. The Golden Gate Bridge See entrance it. was destroyed by the Soviets during the war. Protect the time machine until you can capture enough power plants to bring it online. Be careful, Commander. Yuri's initiates are combing the city. They okay. want these power plants too. Kill the initiates. Commander, these are Guardian GIs. They're armed with both machine guns and anti-tank rockets. When deployed, they are able to reduce a tank into scrap metal in seconds. We can also kill her as well, but she doesn't. She doesn't like to say that. Because you know that'd be like really helpful. New rally point is That's not how she rolls. Training. Right. So uh, yeah, like I said, I've already played this one through once, Unit ready. and uh, so it's pretty good. It's pretty easy. Oh my god, they're so slow. Unit ready. Then they are carrying an entire like, fucking building on their back. Unit ready. As well as like a rocket launcher, but still, I mean, come on. Unit ready. Need a conversion? Yeah, you can get the yeah, you got to catch a four of these. There's like two here. And then there's like, there's like two down here Unit as well. Ready. And generally kill that big motherfucker. It's not too hard. Unit so, yeah, when it comes New back, you go back in time, like a load of shit comes on up here. Like a load of shit, so I'm gonna get a yeah, good amount of people that way. Around you, you should be able to pull out that to make it look better. Eh, all mine are under attack. So I'm on either like that, don't really care about my troops. God, they are slow. There. Oh, that's it one. 
then also one second. Uh, you know, let's go kill something. This is easy. This is, but they're, they're just picking those guys up. Let's just go kill something. Let's, let's kill these guys. Let's kill, kill you. Kill all yours. Actually, these are initiates, aren't they? Let's go kill all the initiates. Get, get them all now. Just sort all these guys out. Okay, I've got the mir Mirage tanks there, which... I mean, they really do... They, they kick the hell out of infantry. Which is lovely. Which is nice. It's nice. And, uh, we need another one of those. Because, basically, in this game... You put engineers, like, anywhere not inside a tank, they just, they get owned so quickly by, well, like they get owned by everything, so, we got them in the tank, which is a little annoying, but, I suppose it, could, it speeds the game up a bit, but I'm particularly, I, I play this game pretty slowly, usually, I like to build a nice base, make sure I'm all nice and Safe and snugly in the base before going to attack anyone. So I'll, I'll, I'll try and play it a bit quicker. Might, might end up with me having to replay it more and more, but oh well. Shouldn't be too bad. There we go, we've got two of them now. Okay. Yeah. No. They'll, they'll go and get these guys. The GIs are one of the more overpowered infantry there is. Yeah, they are. Which is what you want. Unit ready. You always want things to go New rally point established. Training. So I'll just keep doing these for a while. I've got the knowledge. I won't be in repair. Unit ready. I won't be in there. Right, let's go and secure a bit for the engineers. Now these things aren't that bad until they get up to full speed, where they become slightly broken. But they're not, not too bad, but yeah, they can be a little pain in the ass. So let's do them, and then we'll kill off these guys. Because you actually you only need to capture these two. These two power plants, and you've got enough power. Um, yeah, we're there. Yeah, we'll five more. You're over there. And, uh, yeah, just to the end of And, I found it rather annoyingly, I found that you don't have to defend the power at all afterwards. Cause, which is annoying because in the first time I did it, I put like a reasonable amount of defences on the power. It took rather longer doing it, and then found out it's totally useless after you get back in time. So I'm gonna move everything back over here because this, this is this is where all the shit goes down anyway. This is, it all goes down over here. So yeah, let's get on back there. Commander, the time machine is powered up. We're ready to make the time shift. Let's shake it, baby. <laughs> Hang on, this is going to be a close one. Wow. I fear you are out of time. Don't worry. It will be quite painless. And life will be so much simpler for you with no freedom of will. Well, basically, fuck you, Yuri. Because we're going we're, we're gonna to cock all your plans up. We're going to go back in time and balls everything up for you. Because I'm, I'm very good at ballsing things up. Incoming transmission. <laughs> In general. So, yeah. See, look. Everything's over here. You did it, so Commander. The time shift was here. successful. And yeah. But we couldn't have come at a worse time. Yeah. We're sitting right in the middle of the first Soviet occupation. Use the Grand Cannons to soften up the Soviets. And when you give me the word, I'll swim to Alcatraz and I'll turn that psychic dominator into scrap metal. 
that's it. This is the thing you got to worry about, really. This fucking Kira. Because Kira, oh, they do so much damage. We need to get everything right. Kill it. Kill it. Come on, kill it. There we go. Is it still going to... No, that's good. That's all good. Yeah, and after that... Uh, what is it? Tanks? I think there's some tanks that attack us. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. These these tanks are going to come attack us as well. But they're, they're not lucky. Because these guys really do just turn tanks into just scrap so quickly. You don't need to worry about tanks. You know these guys are. You don't even really need to worry about planes. Our base is under so, yeah, you see. Yeah, they're gone. Our base is under and the ground cannons will just happily pick away. Oh, what's happening here? Yeah. Okay. Bit of a no. Oh, what the hell? Um. Okay. <laughs> no idea what was happening there. Game just decided to bug a bit. Oh well. And another th yeah. It's not really that much of a bother because time is just ridiculously good at blowing things up. I mean, the Soviets on this, they have a guy called Boris, can do the same sort of thing, but he can't swim. Entirely can. Yeah, for some reason, that the Russians, Russians don't swim in this universe. They don't like it. And these things, when I first played it, I thought they'd just kill her. They're just like tear into mush, but apparently what they're firing is just like bags of ink. So what they've done is just painted her. Some very conveniently placed barrels, which also help. I mean, it really is just as simple as walking over. This is a nice early introduction to the game. Nice and simple. And that's it. So, yeah, cheer. Cheer for Floyd. Mission's accomplished. Uh, you are quick thinking, caught both the Soviets and Yuri off guard. The Soviet invasion of San Francisco has been thwarted, and Yuri's plans have been thrown into disarray. Well done, Commander. Well, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I did it in I did it in nine minutes, and I think take twenty. So maybe I'm not as bad at this game as I thought I was. I was playing because I'm pretty bad at it. Didn't want to be boring. So um, anyway, yeah, that's my first little bit of gaming. Check out the rest of the stuff on the channel. Uh, Matt does vlogs and some Pokemon. He's very good at Pokemon, much better than me. Uh, I'll, I'll keep doing this, and maybe some Pokemon as well. And um, yeah, so until next time, uh, have fun. Thank you.